No, we're live. Are we? We are live for sure. We're live. It's fl it's fl it's blurry. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's blurry. Why is it blurry? Our eyes. I don't know. Do we have anybody on with us today? This no, has been no, nothing. It was a struggle. The it was. Oh, oh, we're on. Look at there's the the garbage or the people for the real problems. Yeah, the real problems. Anybody on with us this morning? Pardon my shit. Wipe in the camera. <laughs> Because it's blurry. Okay. What do we got here? Okay. Well, we have stuff for you guys. So if you watch it later or whatever. Um, patterns are on sale this week. Patterns are on sale. We have to draw a winner. Off. We do. Let's draw a Should winner. we draw the winner yeah. first? Okay. The first thing we have to do, this is for the big chocolate Easter bunny out there. Yes. Good morning, And we Pat. have everybody's cards in here. All the things. Toss them all around. You want to draw one? Okay, I'm not looking, I'm not looking. Dorothy Titus. Oh, Dorothy Titus. Dorothy Titus. Gra congratulations, Woo Dorothy. Woo you can come to Creekside and pick up your chocolate bunny at your convenience. Yeah. We are open until... Does Dorothy watch with us? Yep, Dorothy's in here often. Does she watch? I don't know if she watches us or not. Good morning, oh. Pat. Um, <clears throat> Dorothy... We're open until 5.30, Tuesday through Friday, and Saturday we'll be here from 9 to 3. So you can pick up your bunny whenever you would like to, or give us a call and we'll figure something out. I finished something this Ooh, week. Ooh, what'd you finish? I finished something. I'm shocked. I know. Look at, I finished, I finished this. It's a baby blanket, and it's made with our baby yarn, um, soft serve. It took three, three balls. Oh, that's um, not too bad. No. And it was knit. It's knit. And Donna is going to come. Not this Donna. I have a lot of Donnas in my life. <laughs> Donna Haggerty is going to come in on the next open knit and help teach me how to block something. Because in all the years I've been knitting, I've never blocked anything. I've never blocked anything. I just either. say, oh, look, it's done. Yeah. Here yeah. you go. This is what it's supposed to look like. <laughs> but it's kind of wavy. But she says that it will work. So we're going to see. Yeah. Stay tuned for more. But I did finish something, so I was pretty impressed with myself. Tula is coming. Yes. And I'm playing with Tula at home. And because my my plans for today have been redefined this evening, yes. I, I get to sew tonight. Ooh. I know. Ooh. And then Lisa made this quilt for us, so be hey, ready for this. This, this one is, is wild. loud. I I love it, but look it. It's a case. Oh, it looks it looks nice on the camera. Yeah. But it is it is a loud, loud quilt, but it's beautiful. So we saw this pattern, which is on sale, Optics, and it was by a new designer. Her name, uh, Confident Beginner Studio 180 Friendly Pattern by Tamarini, Tamarinus, um, depends, I guess, on how we say that word, Tammy Silvers. Um, so I made a, an account with her and asked for this pattern. I saw it in when Free Spirit brought the yes. cake. That was like yes. one of the very first projects I bought. Mm -hmm. Sandy cautioned me that you all were not ready for cake. Good morning, Darlene and Tammy. So if you like cake, we do have the fabrics here yep. to make this pattern and the pattern's on sale, 20% off. Yeah. Oh, and we had a great bus trip on Friday oh, and right. Saturday. It was a lot of fun. Um, we had some changes. Everybody was flexible. A lot of laughs with old friends and new friends. Um, it, it was a lot of fun. It was an awful lot of fun. So we need to do another one. Another bus trip. I think we should go to Paducah next year. We could. For the AQS. Yeah, that would be fun. That would be a lot of fun. That would be a long trip. That's okay. We made it, though. We had a great time. Uh, hi, Audrey. Hi, Janice. Where would we stop? You guys throw us some ideas because I'd, I'd love to do another bus trip. Yeah. But yep. this time I might go. Maybe in the spring and the fall. Yeah, two a year. Mm hmm. Do one in the spring, one in the fall. And Can we go to Missouri Star? Oh, I'd love that. Oh, yeah. We'll stop by my aunt's house. There we go. We can all stay camp there. It would be camping. <laughs> it would be, it's not that big. There's only three bedrooms. <laughs> Our Floriani orders are all in from the event. So if well, you haven't picked. Well, almost. Do we have a couple back ordered things? Yeah, but the My Design album came in. Oh, good. So who, okay. I, I don't remember who was I've got them that. written. I got them written down. She's on top of that. Yep. Um, so we have, those are all in and ready for pickup. 
Um, good morning, Christine. Uh, and you can get those whenever, whenever works for you. We've got them all packed and ready to go. I can't wait to try some new things that I got from there. Look at this new pattern. So, oh, yeah. um, we had this fabric come in and I didn't love it, but I was searching for the patterns and I love the pattern. So this is the pattern. It comes in a white option or a black option. I really love the black. Yeah, I was going to say, they make it look like to two it, totally different Yeah, pills. it's fat quarter friendly. So it goes with this Water Lilies fat quarters. And this is more of the, the, the patterns, that that, the there. prints that are in there. So um, I only have two fat quarter bundles for that one. This is the border print for it. It's got dragonflies. I don't know if you could see. It's got dragonflies in it. Aren't those pretty? Oh, so this is really pretty. And then this one is really pretty too. The water lilies. Whoops, upside down stuff. With the dragonflies. So that pattern is in here with all of this stuff to make it. And Donna told me that you guys were admiring this quilt. This pattern is in store. And this fabric has shipped. I got the shipping notification. Okay. Yep. So I don't and know where it's coming from. If you got the birds of a feather um, you don't embroidery, need the embroidery CD. CD for this. No, but if you got that, this kind of goes with it. This is yes. the same birds of a feather thing. So if you're not an embroiderer, you can still um, participate in having birds of a feather things. And this is one of my new favorite pattern places to buy from. It's called Three Dog Design. And I can get any other stuff, but I love, love, love this. So if you're a paper piecer, this is such a beautiful pattern. Um, so those we have in stock. You would not appear in my Facebook page. We had trouble this morning too, Nancy. Um, we, that's why we were late getting on. We were early getting on. And I had to reboot. Not, we had to reboot, and then we had to wait and wait and wait. So my camera wasn't playing nice, and none of it was being nice. No. Oh. It wasn't, it wasn't fun this morning. Uh, we have lots of stuff. Nancy has two, with Easter coming, she's got two of her hot pad table runner Look at the sets pad. left. It's got little words. It's cute. So they're not the, in this colorway. They're more spring colorway, oh. the two that are left. Um, we don't have a, one in the spring colors Denise made, made up. That. Denise made this one. So we do have hot pad table runners. That's not a hot pad table Oh, that's runner. not. I grabbed the wrong one. That is a table runner Denise made out of the little patterns yes, that we have. Yes, and, and we have those. We have those. Nancy's hot pad table runners, which we've showed quite a few times. There's only two kits left. I'm sorry, Nancy. I grabbed the wrong one off the... Denise is on a mission to teach us how to use these panels. So she made this for me. I know you guys have seen these panels hanging up. You gotta go higher. Hanging up in the store, the military panels, and this has a little flange. It turned out so cute. Mm -hmm. um, very nice and, and classy. So um, I might have to put some binding and fuzz. I have to put fuzzy on the back of anything I expect Kevin to use because. He likes his cuddle fabric. Yeah. <laughs> so the, we have uh, panels for different um, services. services that you can do the same thing with. And then we have... Oh my gosh, this is oh, such a cute down. pattern. This one Peggy made for us. And this goes with the line we showed a couple weeks ago. The farm line. And we have two kits made up. And this is a panel in the center. And then you do your blocks around the outside. Oh my gosh. Can we fix can we fold it in so we can see the panel? Look at how stinking cute that is. That's it's a panel. pretty big size quilt. It is. It would fit like a twin bed. Yeah. To go with that, we also have a pillow case. You can make a pillowcase that Pat made for us. We have all these this coordinates sewing. with with the fabric line. So if you need a gift for somebody or you're thinking ahead for Christmas, this is the time to do it while we have all this pattern in stock. The pattern, the fabrics are in stock. Um, and we have some kits for some of the things. We have two kits. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. These are pillowcases. You can make, they take 10 minutes to make. You can make these for Easter for the grandkids. 
We have kits all ready for them. And there are no seams inside. Like they're all. You do French seams French on this. French seams. Yeah. yeah. It was so we have so that cute. one and we have the little. And guess what? This is Tula. Shoot. Yep. <laughs> so we have two different colorways of this that you can we do. We have three. Three. We didn't make a sample of the third one, but I wanted the, the blue. Yep. For the bunny. This is yep. just too yep. stinking and cute. So if you need a quick Easter gift for the Easter baskets, you've got it here. They take 10 minutes to make, literally 10 minutes to make. It's so stinking cute. Um, We've got some Nancy's ki uh, classes are coming oh, up. Yes. The Caddy Pad Junior. If you travel with your little mini iron, it's so adorable. You put your iron in here, and it's got the heat resistant inside. Open it up. And then you you have a little iron pad, an ironing pad. And then when you leave your class, if your iron is still warm, it's not going to burn through anything. You just hook it back up, and you're ready to take it home. She's, she's a little on the struggle bus. With yes. The, with the so Nancy's pad. Caddy Pad Junior class. Um, it will be on the website. I tried to put it on yesterday or over the weekend and the, the website wasn't cooperating. It was not cooperating. I typed it out twice and there's a whole long write up. So that was kind of crazy. But yeah. um, so this class is going to be Thursday, May 4th from 10 to 2. It will be on the website soon. And then Nancy will also have a list of things that you need to bring for that class. The class cost is $25. The materials, the materials oh, um, were $20. Are $20. So for $45, you'll get the pattern, and she'll have that all listed when we right. get when we get. Closer. And it will be all in the class purchase. So when yep. you purchase the class, it will, be, it will come out. This is adorable. Oh my gosh, I love this. I love it in the yellow, and I'm not a yellow person. No. Wendy, but, look at this. This is your... Um, Corey Yoder fabric. Isn't that just the cutest thing? This class for the Layered Star Trivet is on Thursday, May 18th from 10 to 2. That is not on the website yet either, but it will be. Um, the class cost for this is 25 The materials is 15 And Nancy will have other information for you um, when you sign up for the class. It will be on the website too. So stay tuned for that. This is adorable. I absolutely love this. And then um, she's got round seven of Saturday Sampler oh, coming. Yes. Um, and we have the sampler ru rules here. Registration fee is for six inch blocks is $36. For 12 inch blocks, it's $72. Uh, the meeting dates, they start May 13th. Oh, that's my dad's it's, birthday. They're on a Saturday. Oh, yeah. so on a Saturday, May 13th, we'll start round seven of Saturday Sampler. That's Caroline's birthday, too. Oh, nice. You oh, need yeah. to sign up, and that, I believe, is on the website or will be. She's pretty good. I keep trying to derail her. And she I know, just keeps and I just going. keep going. She's <laughs> like the Energizer Bunny. And there's no, <laughs> there's no cutoff date. <laughs> Just a heads up, Tula's Everglow and Bright. I saw those, Amanda, on OESV. I know. I know. Go to our website and click the embroidery links, and you can get, yes, get yes. come back in there. Yes. Yep. I have their, um, they gave me an advanced copy, but I, I didn't get it printed out because my, my embroidery machine at home is not big enough. She's already grown out of it. Um, <laughs> hi, Nadine. Yeah, on our website, we have affiliate links, so we, our store gets credit for them if you shop through OESD, if you shop through Sweet Pea, Sweet Pea and Designs by Juju. No. Or not Juju, Kimberbell. Kimberbell. I'm sorry, Listen, Kimberbell. Um, and had, Sweet Pea has that ethereal block of the month, but I cannot find the fabric requirements, so I don't want to start until I it's, know. It's different. They don't give you yardages. They give it to you in the cutouts for the size that you choose But for to each do. month. I know. It's on the so side. So I don't even know no, right. if I'm going to use black fabric. Right. Like, what if I want to use my scrap batiks? Right. Yep. Like, it's crazy. Yep. So we have lots going on, lots of classes coming. Shop hops are coming. We have one. We have a shop hop coming in May. It's the Cookie Crumb Trail. That's a Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. All mm -hmm. shops will be open until 5 on Saturday, um, whether they are or aren't. And then in June, we have the great... American the Great Western New, New York, York Shop Hop, Hop, which is a two-week-long Shop Hop. Yes. And there's 25 shops. 
Yeah, 25 shops. So there's two routes, and we'll go over I that I want to know closer. who manages to get to all 25. I know, right? Right. For real. So that more details will be coming. We showed you the pillowcase. Tip of the week. Oh, we forgot Tip that. Tip of the week. We almost forgot that. When you're pressing seams and you want a nice flat seam, and I'm thinking like your your thicker seams, like when we do the Kimberbell cuties and things like that, we iron them, but they aren't necessarily laying flat. Once you iron them, you lay the wooden clappers, which this is a gypsy, you lay the wooden clappers on top of the seam that you ironed and let it sit there for a minute. When you, it absorbs, the, it keeps the heat in, the wood does, and it keeps the, the seams flat when you finally take it off. You'll have nice flat seams. This works great, the wooden clappers. Why does it work? They come in different sizes. I don't know the whole philosophy behind it, but I don't understand. They, they work. I use it mine all the time. I use it all the time. I have different sizes. So you can use these in the hoop too. If you have a smaller size clapper and you have to press something open in the hoop, you lay it flat, you lay this on top of it after you hit you hit it with your heat, and this will keep your seam flat. Do we have any of those? We have uh we did. I don't know if we still do, but we do have these. We do carry these. So, and those fit in the hoop, all the hoops? Well, no, this will fit in a 5x7. So if you have a 4x4, four 5x7, four, it will go this way. But if you have a 4x4, four four, you'd need a smaller a smaller clapper. Because you want this to sit directly on your fabric to keep your seam flat. So we need to look at if we have those and order some. Yes, we need to get smaller I'm ones. I'm going to try it out. I'll let you know what I think. It works. Trust me, it works. It works. I don't understand why, but we're gonna we're gonna figure that out. Okay, lots of stuff going on. Easter's this week, so we I think I've covered everything that I had on here. I've done that. I've done that. I've done that. I've she done comes that. with a whole list. It's insane. I do. So um, all right. So remember, Dorothy, you won the chocolate bunny. Come and get it. Let's see. They come from the garment industry, used on woolens for tailoring, but work great for us. Yes, Nancy. Thank you. I'm still gonna try it. <laughs> she doesn't believe you. It's a piece of wood. I know, right? It doesn't make sense. And it's not a heavy piece of wood. It's a light right, like piece of wood. It's not even like, you know, holding the darn thing down. It's just whatever. I know it. So. I know it. All right, guys. All right. Have a great week. And we will see you either in store. If we don't see you, happy Easter. Happy Easter. And we Easter. will see you. We have open embroidery tomorrow. And let's see. Hold, hold steam without burning. But I don't use steam. Do you use steam? Sometimes. It depends what I'm doing. Well, now I'm going to have to look. My <laughs> iron does not like steam. I don't use it for my iron. I spritz it with a water bottle. Okay, I do that. Yeah, that's what I do. But I don't so then when steam. you iron it and you press put this on there, it will hold that steam in there to flatten out the, the seam. Okay, mm -hmm. we'll see. Okay, just, just heat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks, Nancy. Happy Easter, everyone. Have see a you great soon. day. Bye. Bye.